Hey, any luck sorting the yard? <sighs> Stuff all. Still getting call after call from angry dealers that have been left in the lurch by Vinny. We should be back from seeing Liv now. Sooner he drops her, the better. Chaz. Chaz. Oh, great, you got an echo. No excuses. You need to get up to the yard and sort it out. Shove the yard. Do you really hate her that much? Who? Liv, you know, it's bad enough that you've written her off, but now you're told her to cut me loose. Why would you do that? I didn't. You're a liar. But, Vinny. You stop it. Heard you banging on to her this morning how Liv was dragging me down. You know, you did this. But you need to step back. Liv is out of my life, and it sounds like she's out of yours, too. You know what? She's done you a favour, mate, but it's got nothing to do with me. Well, who else hates enough to hurt her like this, then? Me, Vinny. It was me. I, I don't hate Liv. I, no one does, but, but her being in there, it's a mess. What did you do? But that shouldn't mess with you too, sweetheart. You can't put your life on hold because she has. She could be in there for years. What did you do? I, I went to visit her today in prison and I just told her you were struggling and, and how bad it was for you. She told her to cut me off then. No. Oh, but you knew she would though. Well, I hope so, yeah. You're not sleeping or working, you're barely eating. Let's not even been in there for a week. What are you going to be like after a month or a year? She knows that you're not going to give up on her, so she's done the right thing. The only thing... The worst thing! Liv needs me, you know, she's scared, she's vulnerable. You know, she hates herself. She should. But she didn't do it, did she? She's in there by herself and her brother and you, you who saw her like a daughter, just left her there to rot. With good reason. But I don't know what she's got, though. The only one who cares, and you told her to cut me off. You know what I said to you about sticking your beak in? Liv knows she's the only one that deserves punishing. Not you. She was just looking out for you. Liv's the one that cut the cord. Don't blame your mum. I bet I do, though, don't I? Sweet, I... I don't want to hear it! How many times have I told you to back off, stop interfering, but you... You never do, do you? It's like you want to make things worse. Just give him time to call off. He'll be all right. Don't think he will, Bill. I think I've really done it this time. 